it was a great day in the United States of America. Two trains, a diesel engine and a steam engine, were carrying decorations for an important celebration for Halloween, and they were carrying them in their cargo trains. My Steam Train 316 was a quite wise steam engine, but don't worry, he can get the work done at all times. Great work, 316. You managed to deliver the decorations on time, but I'll make sure to have more jobs for you next time. Isn't that right, 316? Uh-huh, said the steam engine. How was your day, 316? Well, it was kind of boring, said 316. How was yours? It was kind of boring as well, said 3001. But I guess maybe one day we're gonna have a real fun day. A good day, you say, 316? You mean like a challenge that we're gonna have tomorrow? Yes, said 3001. What you heard there, that means that 3001 got an idea for a challenge tomorrow. I'm sorry, but I have to interrupt your conversation 3001 and 316. Today, we'll be getting more decorations for the Halloween celebration that's happening this October 31st. So get ready and have a good night's sleep tomorrow. The next morning, diesel number 3001 was already ready, so he went on, but 316 followed behind him because they were getting ready for the cargo trains. But 3001's plan was to have a challenge to see who would carry the most cargo. Diesel 3001, do you think I can do some jobs and carry some cargo trains? Uh, uh, stuttered 3001. He decided to make up a plan. Why don't- I'm sure there are plenty of other jobs out there. Like, other jobs that steam engines can do and diesel engines can't really do. But I'm assuming the cargo trains are perfect for diesel engines, not really some steam engines like you, 316. said 2016. Maybe I have an idea. What if I can probably try and take one of 316's cargo trains? That'll be a perfect idea. My Diesel 3001 was chilling in the yard when 316 was carrying one of his trains. Ah, uh, what a great day it is. I'm taking a little break from my cargo trains, and I don't really think 316 is really carrying one of my trains, but, uh, wait. Is that him carrying my trains? 316, what are you doing? 316 didn't really notice 3001 chilling in the yard, so he carried on his merry way with his work. Oh my goodness, 316 is carrying my train. I gotta think of something fast. Wait, I know. I'll get in the way of him in order to stop him.
Wait, what the? 3001? What are you doing in my way? I'm sorry, 316, but I guess your train belongs to me. Alright, fine, 3001. Here's your Halloween train for the decorations so you make everyone happy. Here you go. Huh, I just really hope sooner or later he heals a rail or something. I just really hope Diesel 3001 will just make a change for once and let me carry his cargo trains. Hello, 316. Yes, Conductor. I have some news for you. Diesel 3001 has somehow derailed before he got to his destination. Wait, really? So does that mean I can take care of his trains? Yes, 316, you are allowed to take care of one of Diesel's 3001's trains. <laughs> Meanwhile, at the derailment, 3001 was hanging on his side, and he felt guilty of himself. I might have shouldn't really have accepted this challenge, so maybe I can probably just try and forgive him and say I'm sorry before he gets here. So, I guess you're gonna forgive me and what you were saying because you were basically treating me like a steam versus diesel train challenge. Yeah, I forgive you, 316. How about next time we just do our jobs properly? Okay, said 316. Great work, 316. Now that you have delivered the Halloween decorations on your cargo trains, you are now awarded for the best steam engine, or probably my oldest steam engine, to work, and you delivered the Halloween decorations on time. So I congratulate you. Oh, thank you, Conductor. Thank you all. Now back to Diesel 3001. He will make sure to learn a lesson and will also make sure not to do any more challenges featuring steam engines and diesel engines. Now I think that he should deserve a lesson, wouldn't you?